Sunday is just a few days away and many will be doing the tradition of decorating eggs. And if you're looking to learn maybe a traditional way of decorating, why not visit the Polish Art Center? They have special courses going on this week. Jordan and Troy are here with them now. Can't wait to see these eggs, you guys. Okay, just to preface, I think <laughs> uh -huh. Troy's egg is going to look a lot better. I don't than know. Mine. I don't know. He's I have already a tool ready. And an egg ready to go. So we know who we are. We've yes. got Michelle Gordon over here at Hello. the Polish Art Center. We've got a yes. plethora of things up here on yeah. the table. What would you like to start with today? So I come from the Polish Art Center. My parents uh, have been in business for 51 years. And my mom taught me how to do this wonderful, wonderful craft. It's uh, you write on raw chicken eggs or duck eggs, whatever you'd like. It's a system of waxing and writing with hot beeswax onto the eggshell, preserving whatever you cover, and then dipping it into a color, writing more, dipping it into another color, adding wax as you okay. go. When did this begin? When did this wow. tradition begin? Do you know how long? It's a very, very old tradition yeah. and has been passed down to, from generation to generation. Okay. The idea is that everything that you write on an egg has meaning. Okay. And then mm -hmm. those meanings are passed on as a welcoming of spring. Okay. Okay. So these are all your your. Well, I put creations. an example here. We've got some gorgeous. here that wow. I've made. Wow. No, uh, this is very popular in the Ukraine as well. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So my dad's mom was born in Ukraine, and we have a lot of these eggs around our house. Okay. And my dad has always tried to, he was always wanted to learn how to do this. Mm -hmm. Well, he never, we never got to doing it, so now chance. I'll be able to show him that I was able to learn this yeah. um, here so on air, too. Explain again okay, the here, wax. How the does, what's the process again so we can so actually try this? So you have a raw this. egg. You're okay. going to heat your tool up. Yeah. Set in okay. the middle here, right? Yeah. All right. Oh. And you're going to get the barrel nice and warm. And okay. then yours is our, uh, Mine's I think warm? you already okay. have beeswax. You might need to load yours. And then you're plenty hot. And then you're going to lay it in the beeswax, okay. load up your tool. Okay. Oh, I see. Then it as melts. As long as your tool is warm, it should write like ink. Melts it, gets oh, it in there, right? Okay. okay. And then we just make designs on it. I see. Look, look. There we go. What's that supposed to be? I mean, it's it's artistic. This is art. That's what um, we're making here. Compared to that, I'm not sure. Listen, it's art. <laughs> it looks good. What do you think? I can't do any better. I can't do any better. I think better, all right? Pisanki are beautiful. Thank so you. we offer the workshops. Uh, we have a lot of classes in April, Fridays, mm -hmm. Saturdays, and Sundays. Mm -hmm. We teach ages eight and up. Okay. This okay. is a really fun uh, workshop to take. You don't have to be artistic. Like me, I'm struggling. No, you don't have to be. This is folk art, so everyone can do folk art. Right. Now, how would we do different colors? Uh, because my so color is the same. So everything you've written on your egg now is preserving white. You okay. would then dip into your first color, which would be yellow. Okay, should and I try then, that? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, go, go for, for it. For You're, it. I'm putting mine down because you already weighed. Oh, come on, just draw, do a design. I tried, I tried. Draw like I like a triangle or, or a something? square or a circle. Yeah, let's try. Here, yeah. I've got so one after here. a series of dyeing and writing on your egg, yeah. we would come up with this egg, which has got no. all of the wax still left on. But how okay. do you get the wax off? Okay. See, we're, we're gonna, gonna melt the. Oops, we're gonna melt the wax off. Okay. Got some tools over there. All right, we're gonna keep trying to draw. All right, you're gonna do that. Okay. And so, to get the the wax to come off in the end to reveal all of your beautiful colors and your designs, you're gonna heat the wax up and then melt it away. And you have to be careful not to burn your. Oh, what? That's what? crazy. Did you see that? That's yeah. so cool. I mean, you have to be very careful too not to burn yourself. Yeah. But um. Yes, but you know yeah. what? Children can do this. All right. This is um. I would not be afraid. I, my children have been doing it since they were very little. Well, it's beautifully done. Tell us again yeah. about the class. How can we be a part of this class if we want to learn? So we've got workshops on our website. Um, you can come in the store. We do groups of 10, up to 10. Sometimes we do whole families. You can come by yourself. You can come in a group. You can bring wine if you like. All right. Um, she had me at wine. Yeah. One of the most fun parts is emptying out your egg, which a lot of people used to do by mouth. Okay. Oh, but we've okay. got this really awesome tool. I've already put the hole in the egg. Oh, okay. Oh, and then, okay, oh, so this is a raw egg, egg and we're emptying it. Here okay. we go, emptying the egg. Well, that is a great Those idea. Those look I, awesome. Michelle, thank you so much for coming <laughs> on CBS welcome. News Detroit today. Polish Art Center, it's where me. you want to be if you want to get your hands on these beautiful eggs and do some yourself. Yeah. Troy, I'm we'll going to break one on your do head, it. I think. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> thank you again, Thanks Michelle. Appreciate me. it.